Google Keep has many built-in features to help you organize your notes, such as color coding, labeling, and pinning them. You can also insert images and links to add more detailed information. In this lesson, we'll show you some organizational tips and features so you can find what works best for you. We'll start this lesson with some example notes already created. If you want to learn how to create a note, checklist, or reminder, check out our Google Keep tutorial linked in the video's description. For this lesson, we'll be using an iPhone, so there may be some subtle differences if you're using an Android phone. Let's take a look at the anniversary reminder note. To make the note stand out, we'll add an image. Tap the square plus icon, followed by selecting Choose Image. You may need to allow Google Keep to access your phone's images. After selecting a photo, it will appear on the note. Since this is an important reminder, let's pin the note to the top of the home screen. Tap the Push Pin icon on the top toolbar. Now let's change the note color. Tap the More icon, then select the color that you want. Tap the back arrow to return to the home screen. Notice that the note has been pinned to the top. When you create a new reminder, we suggest making it the same color for consistency. Now, we'll scroll down to see the other notes. The grocery list note is missing a few things. Let's add what we need using the voice to text function. Tap the square plus icon, then tap recording. You may need to allow microphone access in your phone's settings. Now, what you say will show up on the screen. For example, chocolate chip cookies, lemonade. Once you are done recording, it will take you back to the note. It's important to note that what you say may not always be grammatically correct while using voice capture. But Google Keep also adds the voice recording to the note to help. If you don't want the recording, tap the X followed by Delete. The text from the recording will remain. To categorize the note, tap the More icon followed by Labels. Tap Enter Label Name. In our example, we'll type Groceries, then the plus sign to create the label you'll see the label show up at the bottom of the note. To add a label to a note from the home screen, tap and hold for a second, then let go. The top toolbar will appear. Tap the label icon. Since this note is a to-do list, let's make a label called important. When you are done, tap the back arrow to see the label added to the note. To see all of your labels, tap the main menu icon. You'll see the labels listed in the menu pane. Simply tap the label to see the note in that category. The National Parks note has a bunch of links. To add a link, you can copy the URL and simply paste it into the note. Whenever you need it, copy and paste it into your phone's web browser. If you have many notes to look through on your screen, you can use the Search Your Notes feature. The search provides some suggestions to help you find what you're looking for, such as labels or colors. You can also type some keywords. Once you have found the note, tap it to view it. What's great about the Google Keep app is that you can make the app reflect you and how you think and process things. You'll be able to sort your notes exactly the way you want.